Minister Dr. Sri Muhammad Ali Rustam has been found guilty of involvement in money politics. The decision was announced by AMNO Disciplinary Board Chairman Tengku Tan Sri Ahmad Rithaudin Tengku Ismail on Tuesday. As a punishment, the AMNO Vice President has been barred from contesting for the Deputy President post in the upcoming AMNO Party elections, which will be held in less than 10 days. Apart from Muhammad Ali, 14 other AMNO members have been found guilty of violating the party's code of ethics, including AMNO Youth Vice Chief Kari Jamaluddin. However, the Rumbau MP was only given a warning and would be able to contest the AMNO Youth Chief Post. Speaking in federal capital, Tunku Ahmad Ridaudin said the board found Muhammad Ali and Kairi guilty of violating Article 10.1 of the AMNO Members' Code of Ethics. Muhammad Ali's offence was connected directly to the offence committed by his political secretary, Saadun Basirun, who was also found guilty and has been suspended from AMNO for three years. You see, yeah. <laughs> Ialah boleh katakan banyak bawah jatuh pada uh, kes nombor empat. Nombor empat, kes nombor empat. Sa'adun bin Basirun. Siasa politik dia. So, jadi apa yang dilakukan, dibuat oleh dia, kesalahan dia buat bagi duit ke kempen, bagi makan, maka disifatkan dia juga pesalah. Tapi dia tak buat. Dia sendiri dia tak buat pada ketika itu yes. Jadi dia mengikut keadaan yang dibuatkan oleh ejen dia ni, Iaitu apa ni, Saadun ni Maka dia terlibat sama Maka dia kena beli, memberi penjelasan Jadi dia sebesar politik kepada uh, uh, Ketua Menteri ini even though Kairi was found guilty, he was only given a warning because he was connected to a party election agent, but his connection to the agent was weak. Therefore, his punishment was not as heavy as Muhammad Ali's and that he would be able to contest for the Amno Youth Chief Post. But because there is no link that he gave direct consent, maknanya consent betul-betul, ataupun you go and do it for me, so you can't charge or then take the same sentence with his agent. So that is why... And furthermore, the nexus to link Yang Berhormat Khairi to the agent too is weak. Tengku Ahmad Rithaudin also announced that six other AMNO members were suspended for three years for various offences. Among them, Sabah Youth Chief Datuk Japlin Hakim or Abdul Hamid, Bandar Tun Razak Wanita AMNO Division Chief Haja Salma Pin, and Bukit Kata Putri AMNO Division Vice Chief Zalina Ismail. Four other members were suspended for a year and four others were given warnings. The disciplinary board also announced that 13 members were investigated and found not guilty of money politics, including AMNO Youth Chief Candidate Datuk Sri Dr. Muhammad Kher Toyo. Tengku Ahmad Ridaudin said the disciplinary board's announcement was in no way connected to the AMNO's party election to be held next week.